What's good about Russia in Victoria too? Russia is a very large nation and it stretches from coast to coast, which allows you to play in Europe as a major power and also as kind of a minor power in Asia, where you can do some colonizing and other actions, especially in Central Asia. Russia starts with a lot of pops, which makes it easy for them to industrialize once they get the ball rolling a little. Russia also starts with a massive military, and although it's not that strong at the beginning of the game, it has potential to roll over pretty much anyone in Europe. There's a lot of great events for Russia and cool decisions that you can choose, so that's why I think Russia is a fun nation. One thing that's not so fun, though, is the amount of rebels that you get in this country. They pop up all over the place, and they're always trying to create something called the Soviet Union. So here are the ratings for Russia, and that's why you should play Russia in Victoria too.